Do you want to learn how to make the letter I with the right angle weave technique? Well, I'll teach you how to do it after the jingle. <music> Hi everyone and welcome back to this new tutorial. In this tutorial I will show you how to make the letter I with the right angle weave technique. The letter I is really easy to do and uh, obviously uh, the process is the same of the one of the steps uh, of the other letters uh, so you can as you can see in the H we have the I letter but uh, in this tutorial I'm going to um, decorate the I in a different way uh, we will need some 15 O some 11 O and some rondel beads of the size 3 millimeters for 2 millimeters and obviously uh, a size 12 needle I'm using pony and fire line thread size 0 0.15 millimeters so let's start and pick up four rondel beads and bring them at the end of the thread as always as i have showed you in the previous tutorials now pass through the first rondel bead and pull the thread pass again through all the whole sequence of beads with the thread without adding any bead. As you can see, we have the thread exiting the right rondel bead downwards. Now we have to pick up three rondel beads and pass through the same rondel bead from which the thread exits and pass through it from the top to the bottom in this way and pull the thread then pass through the next rondel bead I have just rotated the, the, the work and uh, the side rondel bead. To make our eye we will need uh, seven modules. So now we have done uh, two modules and we need five more modules. Pick up three more rondel beads and pass through the same rondel bead from the bottom to the top and pull the thread pass through the top bead and the side bead and go on in this way to make the other modules pull the thread and we have just made one two and three you can count the modules uh, counting the middle bead of each module so one two three so go on uh, in this way and uh, make four modules more uh, so uh, i'm going to make the uh, missing modules uh, and i'll show you the final result in a while as you can see we have just finished uh, to make uh, the seven modules and now we are going to decorate uh, our stripe with uh, 11 o seed beads and uh, 15 o seed beads for this letter i'm going to make something a little bit different from the other letters as you can see in the a i have uh, added some 11 o seed beads in the external part of the letter and 15 o in the internal part of the letter but in this letter i'm going to add 1 15 o, 1 11 o, and 1 15 o, and pass through the next rondel bead so i'm going to make the corners of the eye in a different way to make the corners more 
um, defined. So pick up again 150, 1110, and 150, and pass through the next rondel bead in this way. Now you have uh, to add only 11-0 seed beads in the two sides of the eye and uh, in this way pick up one 11 and pass through the next uh, roundel bead until you reach the other corner on the other side of the of the eye once you have reached the, the corner you have to repeat the same step pick up one 15 -0. 1 11 0 seed bead and 1 15 0 seed bead and pass through the next rondel bead in the middle pull the thread and repeat the same step on the other side pick up 1 15 0 1 11 0 and 1 15 0 and pass through the next rondel bead then you have to fill the empty spaces with 11 o seed beads on the other side of the eye so pick up one 11 o and pass through the next rondel bead in this way and repeat the same step until you have filled all the empty spaces now i recommend you to pass the thread again through the beads to hold the beads to make the letter stronger so uh, I make this step uh, one or two times I have to say that I love so much this kind of decoration in the corners uh, because uh, it gives uh, the letter a uh, more realistic uh, shape and for this letter, I have decided not to add any loop uh, on the corners uh, of the letter because uh, we are going to add uh, some jump rings. So one jump ring uh, on the left side and one jump ring on the right side, passing through the 11 0 seed bead. And in this way, you can use the eye as a pendant for your necklace or um, whatever, I don't know, uh, your keychain uh, as a herring, uh, um, etc. You can also add uh, one jump ring instead of two. And uh, in this way, it's more easy to um, use it as a pendant. As you can see, I'm going to open the jump ring and uh, using two pliers and then I'm going to connect the jump ring to the right uh, 11 OC bead in this way. Then with the plier I'm going to close the jump ring and the right part is ready. Then I'm going to open the, the other um, jump ring and uh, connect it uh, to the left side of the eye. And uh, as you can see, this is the final uh, result. You can connect uh, a chain on the left side and on the right side of the eye. And uh, um, in this way, you can uh, wear uh, the eye as a pendant and as a necklace. So this is the final result. Hope you like it. Uh, please let me know in the comments what do you think about these tutorials, uh, these letter tutorials and share the video if you find them uh, useful. Uh, thank you so much for watching and please don't forget to uh, subscribe to my channel. You can follow me also on my Facebook page Natalia Savastano Designer. 
Thank you so much for watching and see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye!